With so many amazing players out there amidst the ever-changing competitive landscape, knowing who the best players of a given character are is crucial to being in touch with the state of the meta. He's doing Again? the void <gasps> stuff. Oh! Jesus! How's it going, Smashers? My name is Bonk, and in this series, we'll be taking you through the best players of every character in Smash Ultimate. We'll be going through them in roster order, and in this video, we'll be picking up right where we left off, starting with Jigglypuff. Barring her appearance in Smash Melee, Jigglypuff has historically always been a pretty bad character, so it's no surprise that she's not particularly popular at the top level. Despite this, Jigglypuff still has an incredibly dedicated player base, and even with players like Master Puffy and Speckler nowhere to be seen in the transition from Smash 4 to Ultimate, Jigglypuff would still find herself in capable hands. The best Jigglypuff in Smash Ultimate is generally agreed upon to be Base Mage. Base Mage is from Arizona and regularly attends the Ascension Monthlies, where he regularly performs within the top 32, having a career-long list of set wins over names like Send, Louis Money, and Pandarian. While he hasn't been to too many majors, he did finish with a respectable 97th place at EVO 2019, a feat most Jigglypuffs would be hard-pressed to match. That being said, there are some strong contenders for second place, the most notable of which are Arika and Cannon Red. If you want to be one of the best with your character, just like these players, you need to head over to ProGuides.com, where you can take your game to the next level with 24-7 live coaching, courses taught by pros, and loads of other content. Don't forget to check us out over on the website after the video. The next character we'll be looking at is Peach. With Samsora's ban from competitive play, the title of Best Peach would be up for grabs, a title that he had held a monopoly over since as early as 2016 back in Smash 4. We have good reason to believe that the Best Peach in Smash Ultimate is Mutace. Wait, what? You consider Peach and Daisy the same character? <laughs> Kinda cringe, bro. <laughs> in that case, the Best Peach in Smash Ultimate is, without a shadow of a doubt, Umeki. Umeki has been a top performer with the character since the very beginning, and given his history as the best Peach in Japan during Smash 4, that should come as no surprise. His list of achievements spanning the length of Smash Ultimate's lifespan to date includes results such as 33rd at Genesis 6, 17th at Frostbite 2019, 25th at Umebura Japan Major 2019, an event where he would take a convincing 2-0 set over MK Leo, and this is all not to mention his consistently dominant performances at Japanese regionals as well, including the highly competitive Umebura SP series. With set wins over MKLeo, Kome, Cosmos, Mr. E, and many more, there is no denying that Umeki is by far the best representative for our damsels in distress. Peach is a strong character, however, which means she naturally attracts a variety of capable talents, and some players deserving of honorable mentions are Mutace, Ling Ling, and Meru. You know, for a character that everyone complains is too easy and takes no skill, Bowser is shockingly uncommon at the top level. The only player to find major success with the character is Leon, and his performances with the character are deserving of a lot more credit than he's given. With wins over the likes of Nairo, Mars, Light, and DeBuzz, just to name a small handful, and a lifelong run of impressive tournament placings including 9th at Smash and Splash 5, 9th at Shine 2019, and 25th at Frostbite 2020, this Koopa King practically dwarfs all the others when it comes to his results. But he's not the only Bowser around, and with how quickly Smash Ultimate is evolving, it's not uncommon for new talent to show up at virtually any moment. Some up-and-comers you may want to be on the lookout for are Hero and Gold. Next up, let's take a look at Ice Climbers. For one of the four characters making their first playable appearance since Brawl, Ice Climbers' reception was a cold one, to say the least. It's not that people don't love the adorable mountain-climbing duo, but they're just not all that good. Not to mention incredibly difficult. This wouldn't stop a handful of highly dedicated players from committing themselves to the character, however, and the foremost of these would be Big D, who would drop King Dedede, a character he had made since Brawl, in favor of the climbers. 
Big D boasts a number of impressive tournament placings, including 17th at Main Stage, as well as 25th at Congo Saga and 33rd at Let's Make Big Moves. And among those performances, a number of impressive set wins, including players like Zachray, Proto Banum, and Dark Wizzy. Big D just barely managed to slide onto the Fall 2019 PGRU, making him the first and only Ice Climbers to become globally ranked in Smash Ultimate, further solidifying his spot as the best Ice Climbers in Smash Ultimate. Unsurprisingly, the Ice Climbers are far more popular in Japan than in the West, and aside from Big D, a majority of Ice Climbers' strongest players are Japanese. Some honorable mentions should go to Murasat and Harasen. The next character we'll be taking a look at is Sheik. There's practically no debating that the best Sheik in Smash Ultimate is Void. Admittedly, it did take some time, and a brief character crisis in which he would try out characters like Pichu and Joker, but he did come back around eventually. Reprising his title as the best Sheik, one that he had had since Zero dropped her for Diddy in Smash 4, Void wasted no time at all in picking up some results. Void Sheik has made a number of notable placings, including 9th at Glitch 7, 5th at Main Stage, 13th at Frostbite 2020, as well as 5th at Smash Ultimate Summit 3, with set wins over Meister, Zachray, Salem, and Riddles. Despite her reputation for being a technically demanding character, Sheik is surprisingly popular at all levels of play, and some players definitely deserving of honorable mentions include Kameme, Mr. R, I'm, and Sharp. The best Zelda player in Smash Ultimate is someone who has arguably been the best Zelda for the past three games. If you're not familiar, let us introduce you to Ven. Ven has been by and large the most successful Zelda in Smash Ultimate and the only one to find relative success at the major level. Aside from dominating in his home region of Las Vegas, his performances at regional and major events are some of the most impressive out there for a character like Zelda, and some of the most impressive are his 17th at Prime Saga as well as his 33rd place finishes at Smash & Splash 5, Super Smash Con 2019, Genesis 7, and Frostbite 2020. Some of his notable set wins include Esam, Elegant, and Frozen. Some other Zelda players you may want to check out are Mysterica, Naskino, and Wine. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching, Smashers. Do you agree with our picks? What characters are you looking forward to seeing us cover? Let us know in the comments below. And while you're down there, don't forget to subscribe and click that bell so you can be notified when we upload new videos. That's all, and we'll see you guys in the next video.